Alabama is one of a few states that require customers to pay a sales tax on food. Well, now the city of Birmingham wants to change that, at least for some people. Happening later today, you can find out more about the city's proposed food rebate program. CBS 42 News reporter Britt Moore live with a look at that program this morning. Britt. Our good morning. Yeah, the city council wants to provide some relief for people who oftentimes have to make a difficult decision between food and other basic necessities. This food tax rebate program will be available to anyone living at or below uh, the poverty level. Now, they'd receive as much as $150 for the amount of sales tax paid on groceries. The program is also open to people over 65 and the disabled. Now, Councilor Stephen Hoyt says this is a great way to provide some relief to people in our area. Now, I asked him if down the line he saw Alabama getting rid of the food tax altogether. Here's what he had to say. I would love to see that. Uh, I, I mean, uh, we would probably have a little fight with the state legislature because we can't get uh, an increase in the in the minimum wage. Uh, and so, uh, if that's uh, alarming to them, then certainly a food tax rebate uh, might be overboard. <laughs> Now, Councilor Hoyt says we can see registration begin as early as April uh, through June. Now, the public hearing again happening here at the Crossplex tonight at 6 o'clock. For now, we're live in Birmingham this morning. Britt Moore, CBS 42 News.